What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel and I'm riding solo today but we got Star Wars Celebration. It is on. Star Wars just released a teaser trailer and this is not an exaggeration at all, I don't believe. This is one of the more important trailers that I have personally seen in my lifetime. You know, it's undeniable there is a clear divide currently in Star Wars and regardless of what your last two opinions were of the last two films, Last Jedi and Solo, I, honestly they didn't land with me. Uh, they didn't land with a lot of people. A lot of people loved it. It was great. A lot of people really enjoyed those movies. But there is a community out there who is very down on Star Wars right now. And this is very important to get those people back, to get those people excited again about Star Wars. Star Wars celebration is going on. Let's put that stuff in the past. Let's look forward to the close of this saga. And I am so excited for this. I am not at all concerned. I'm going to be there on day one, regardless of what my opinions were of the last movies. Day one, opening night. I'm excited. Star Wars Episode 9. I'm hopeful that we get a title at the end of this. It's a two-minute teaser. Wow, that's that's pretty awesome. You ready to jump in? I forgot. I'm just used to that. Nikki's not here. You ready to check it out? I'm ready. Let's go. Just got the saber. We've passed on all we know. A thousand generations live in you now. But this is your fight. Oh my god. <laughs> what? Are you kidding me? Lando and the, oh my god. Holy shit, y'all. That was dope. <laughs> that first look was awesome. I got insane level of chills. That shit was... Oh, hearing hearing Luke, seeing Leia, seeing Lando at the, in the Falcon. This is, this is going to be a very nostalgia, strong, strong movie. And the title, Rise of the Skywalker... What does that mean exactly? Does that is that going to signify that someone important is going to be a, a Skywalker? Is that going to have to do with Kylo Ren? Uh, what do you guys think of that? Leave leave some comments on what you think of that title. The one thing I'm not going into this movie with a whole bunch of expectations, but holy shit, hearing Palpatine at the end that was insane. Wow, my expectations. I, I'm. I got into trouble with The Last Jedi with my expectations. I'm going to go in with a little bit more mellow expectations. But the one thing I don't want to happen, and I'm, I'm very nervous about it, and we saw him fighting there. He had his saber, and he was running through with his stormtroopers. Please don't redeem Kylo Ren. Please don't do it. I hope he's not the Skywalker um, that, is, that is being risen. He's had multiple moments where he could turn and, and, and be that good person that he, 
you know, go to the light. And I feel like he's all in now on the dark side between killing Han Solo, between his opportunity with Rey in, in the throne room. And then he didn't, he didn't know Luke wasn't there. He tried to blast him and kill him. Like those are three moments where he's all in full dark side. He needs to stay committed to that. I personally don't want to see a redemption story for Kylo Ren. It would fit too much to the original trilogy. And I want something a little more original. That's kind of where my brain is at right now. If we're sticking to the story of Rey and her parents being nobody, um, there's a bunch of theories out there about who her parents could be. If there is some way that she, there's a lineage to her and the Skywalkers, that would be interesting. I mean, watching her and, and Leia embrace like that is heartbreaking. But I'm excited. That was really awesome. The music was good. The visuals were fucking unbelievable. Some of the places it looks like they're going. I don't know what, what journey they're on. I don't know if they're searching for more Jedi temples. That one structure, that really big, that, that thing looked super awesome. I don't know what Kylo Ren's journey is going to be. Is he going to be on the hunt to go to Mustafar and go to like Vader's temple to like commit more to the dark side? Hearing Palpatine's laugh at the end what <laughs> like that is what uh, that is throwing me off the more than anything i gotta watch this trailer like a hundred more times but initial thought watching right away i thought that was absolutely spectacular jj abrams bringing it home i have faith in him to do it force awakens was exactly what it needed to be to reintroduce star wars to the world and jj is going to wrap this thing up and based off of that first look I am impressed. I, my, my optimism is high. I'm excited. But yeah, what did you guys think of that? Leave some comments down below. Tell everyone. Let Nikki know how much you missed her in this video because we all know that she's the star of the show. She is the star. So yeah, leave some comments down below. What did you think of that trailer? Are you now excited for episode 9? What do you think of the title? What do you think of Palpatine? How cool was it seeing Lando friggin' piloting the Falcon? So much cool stuff in that trailer. Leave them comments like below. Like, subscribe, hit the bell for notifications, and I will see you guys next time. We will see you guys next time. Have a good one. Bye.